What's up guys, John Sonmez here from simpleprogramming.com. And today we are gonna be talking about the quickest way to get to six figures as a software developer. I know that a lot of you guys are already making six figures. That's great. You're still gonna be able to use this advice because I'm gonna tell you how to get to the next level. But I'll tell you that at the end of this video. But for those of you guys that are just starting out, I'm gonna tell you step-by-step step exactly how can you go from beginner to making six figures as quickly as possible. So without further ado, here's the first thing that I would recommend that you do. For most of you, it, the best thing that you could possibly do to jumpstart your development career as quickly as possible is to go and join a coding bootcamp. Now, before you crucify me on this, hear me out. I don't want you to just join a coding bootcamp. So there's gonna be a pre-step. Before you join the coding bootcamp, I want you to pick out uh, a couple of coding boot camps. There's a lot of really good ones out there. It, it doesn't really matter which one you pick as long as it's, it's reputable. Don't worry about the price so much because the price really is not gonna matter in the long run, okay? But what I want you to do is three months before you even join the coding boot camp, I want you to start studying their curriculum. Most of them, they'll tell you what they're gonna teach you. And I want you to go to a place like freecodecamp.org. You can find a lot of information out there. You can just look on YouTube. You can subscribe to one of the online training sites. There's plenty of these that have subscription that will give you all kinds of access to tutorials and technology. You can go to Udemy if you want and download courses from there for fairly cheap. But I want you to pretend like you're already in the coding bootcamp and I want you to study for three months trying to learn everything they're going to teach you. Now, the reason why you're gonna do this is because when you get into the coding bootcamp, what you're gonna do is you are going to help other people and you're gonna excel. You're gonna be the best person in the class or, or near the top of the class because you'll have already gone over a lot of this stuff and taught yourself this stuff. Now, you're, you're gonna get some assistance because now you're gonna be able to use, instead of using the instructor's time to learn basic stuff you could be learning on your own, you're gonna be able to ask complicated questions. You're gonna be able to ask smart questions. You're gonna be able to help other people and actually go a lot further. If you're gonna pay this money, right, why pay someone to teach you something that you can just learn from a tutorial? It doesn't make any sense. Instead, you're gonna have an instructor there and they're gonna be able to help you with more complicated issues because you'll be ready for those things. Now, what's gonna happen is that a lot of coding boot camps they end up placing students, right? Sometimes they have placement rates of like 20% or top 10% or whatever. If you are the top student in that class, you are going to get the job. And you might get a six-figure job right off the bat there. I've seen many of the guys that I've coached that have gotten six-figure jobs. If you want some help with this, if you want some help, I've helped a lot of people to be able to do this, definitely email me. You can contact me on my, my bulldog mindset.com website. I've got a coaching program on there. I usually have a wait list for it, but I can help you for sure to do this. Very easy once you know what to do. So then the next thing that I, what I want you to do is you're going to get a job from there. I want you to start applying for jobs. I have a software development digital toolkit. In fact, if you buy the book, if you buy the complete software developer career guide in that there is a, a, a coupon to get. The, the toolkit that has a spreadsheet that shows you exactly how to do a job search and how to do all this stuff. But what I want you to do next, if you haven't gotten a job already from the coding bootcamp, is I want you to make your full-time job, and you need to plan this ahead of time, I want you to give a month of your time to working eight hours a day applying for jobs. I'm not kidding you here, right? If you don't have a job, your job is to find a job. So many people that start looking for jobs as software developers, they spend like a couple hours a day, if even, or a couple hours a week, I want you to spend eight hours a day, legit. I want you to work on your resume for an hour a day. I want you to work on your cover letter. I want you to do some networking. I want you to apply for at least five jobs a day and only five jobs, maybe 10 at the most, where you're gonna be very detailed. You're gonna write a custom cover letter. You're gonna customize your resume for it. You're gonna do research on the company before you apply for the job. You're gonna do very detailed, like every single application counts, not just this click, 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 send stuff, okay? I promise you, I've worked with many software developers and helped them to get jobs, and this is gonna be the most effective way. So you're gonna spend your time doing that. If you do that for a month, I guarantee you'll get a job. It's pretty much guaranteed. Now, you've done the coding bootcamp, right? You've gotten some kind of a job. Now, what you're gonna do now is you're gonna spend the next six months at this job, this first job that you got, that might be an under six-figure job, and you're gonna work your ass off. 
You're going to do the best work that you can. But while you're doing this, you're going to create a side project. You're going to pick a technology and hopefully it's a technology you're already working with, but you're going to create a side project and your goal is to release the side project in six months. You're working this new job and you're going to do the side project. It's going to be a lot of work. Now, at the end of the six months, what I want you to do is I want you to now start applying for jobs again. At this point, you're gonna be able to put on your resume this current job that you have, and you're gonna be able to list this side project, and you should be immediately starting on another side project. If you do this, and you start applying for jobs, you're gonna spend the next month, again, it's not gonna be your full-time job, but you're gonna spend at least three to four hours a day just applying for jobs, all right? If you do this, you're gonna be able to move up to a six-figure job within a year. I, I can almost guarantee you it, most developers, can do this because once you have a job, it's so much easier to get a job and there's so many jobs out there that require you to have some amount of experience. If you've started building your own project and you're employed currently, it's gonna be so much easier to, to get a job. Again, guys, if you want some help with this, I do offer coaching. I can help get you a job, it's no problem. Very simple for me to do this as I've worked with so many developers doing this. Just go to bulldogmindset.com and click on the coaching tab there if you want that. If you haven't already, like I said, go check out the digital toolkit. It's you know, a great investment if you want to get a job as a software developer. And I'll put a link in the description as well. You can go check that out. All right, guys. 